Hi guys, I'm going to come out here and talk to Bob, the goat. Um, I know when Kenny and I had to go to town the other day, he must have gotten the house because there was there was these uh, cloven hoof prints on the my laptop. He's he's messing with my keys. He doesn't know how to use a mouse. Hey, come here. Come here. I need to talk to you. Come on. You, now, it wasn't you, because you're kind of dumb, but you're nice here. Um, all right, you. Um, I, since we know that your uncle is great, your great, 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 great uncle is Baphomet, before I give you this, you got to promise that we can do an interview with you tomorrow. Can we do an interview? Say yes? Okay. All right, interview. So, I'm going to have people leave questions. And you, hey, you've got to stay off the internet, you understand? Hey, look at me. Look look at me. You've got to stay off my internet. You're going to tear it up. I mean, look at them things. I mean, I mean, goat porn. You want some books or something? I mean, I know you'll eat them, but, um, but listen, we're, we're really, seriously, we're going to talk about your distant relative, Baphomet, and put it into it so the humans know why the goat did what he did and everything else. And, um, yeah, he smokes here and all that and put into it. How about that? You know, I told some people that I could, I could talk to one of Baphomet's relatives. Yeah, we're see, we see how big you are. Yes, Baphomet actually was from a very big breed of goats. And, and you come up to, well, let's see. He'll start eating me. See, that's pretty tall there okay anyway tomorrow please leave your questions below is that okay Bob 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 is that okay all right hey one more thing did you get chemtrail last night okay I thought so we've got some nasty weather coming in so I'm gonna go in the house we got storms um, it looked like they were chemtrailing last night but I heard him complaining last night so usually that means they're chemtrailing so they're gonna go lay in their little home and uh, everyone just do me a favor leave your um, leave you know your questions for Bob tomorrow and if it's not raining I'll come out tomorrow and interview Bob on his great 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 uncle Baphomet and we can tell you there was a real deal that went down and why the humans considered Baphomet a deity <clears throat> if, from a, if you listen to it from a goat's perspective, humans really sound dumb. It seemed they needed a deity for everything. And according to talking to Bob and Bernard, I mean, they can't even share the same pasture together except in North America. Those people in, in some places in Africa seem to have everything all figured out. Um, even some places over in Europe had it figured out. But he said the rest of the humans are pretty dumb. They don't even know how to talk or listen to animals or trees or anything. So um, we'll get to that basic philosophy of goats and the Baphomet thing. Just clear the air and and give goats a good name again. Um, you see, my, my goat does sneak in the house when we're not at home and gets on the internet. And he reads some of y'all shit y'all put up about Baphomet. What if that was your great 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 uncle people were making shit up about? You know, you'd get offended too. So we'll put it into it. Ask any question you want below, and I'll ask them to Bob tomorrow, weather permitting. Love you guys. Peace.